Yo what's up guys this is Aprix here today in this video you will be getting your answer which is the best 3D simulator for android in 2022 is it the Citra MMG android and it has received major major updates which will be comparing with the Lemurite emulator the brand new UI of Citra MMG android they have also added brand new settings and will be taking a look at the gameplay performance has it improved with a configuration yep so i have also added my configuration which will be linked in description box below but anyways we'll just go ahead and load our games in Citra 3D simulator in Citra MMG Android and as you know in Citra MMG you can also enable cheat codes like 60 FPS cheat codes but I haven't seen enable memory reuse option so I guess this is a new uh, option added in Citra MMG Android turn it on to improve FPS but some games may have display issues or crash in game speed percentage limit you can turn it up to 200% which is 60 FPS you will see options like new 3ds mode which you will have to enable audio stretching has been disabled but anyways so here we go guys let me test out this stock citra mmj android all right this is without the configuration and if you guys know then throughout these years i have created many configuration which work really well on citra 3d simulator and you can see that on my device we'll get straight up 30 fps while emulating any 3ds game uh, such as pokemon x pokemon y and sun and moon etc uh, we'll get 30 fps because those games are capped to 30 fps but if we use the configuration it will bypass the fps limiter and also it will give us over 30 fps so so we saw the fps now let's just go ahead and add our configuration so here as you can see config mmj.ini i have already added it i'll just go ahead and click on copy now you'll just have to go ahead and paste it in the citra emulator folder uh, go to citra emu go to config and paste it right here and it will ask do you want to overwrite it we'll just go ahead and click on replace and as you can see all of our configurations have been added now what we have to do is just go ahead and go back let's reopen the citra mmg android and let's find out moment of truth does the old configuration work with the newer versions of citra mmj and you can see instantly we are getting over 300 fps guys now make sure that it's just the intro screen so fps will drop let's say like to 100 fps or 60 to 100 fps just keep that in mind but anyways let me tell you guys that if you use a configuration your fps will boost according to me but uh, the sound uh, but the audio output will disappear now we'll just go ahead and go back we'll go to settings now we'll just go ahead and enable fmv hacks skip slow draw skip cpu access skip texture copy uh, you can enable linear filter but i don't recommend it we'll set the resolution to 2x and layout to large accurate multiplication to off okay so once that has been done we have maximized everything and we are still getting 120 fps which is really amazing for 3d simulation on android now I know that you guys might have lower end devices or mid range devices but that's where uh, your gameplay experience is improved as 120 fps is just not playable uh, as the speed exceeds over 350 percentage so I, in my opinion 200 percent speed is perfect so if you use configurations on your low end or mid range devices you'll be at least able to get like 30 fps easy but make sure that your device is uh, above snapdragon 450 processor and you also need to have open GLES 3.2 and you can see the game is blazing quick anyways let me just go ahead and close this uh, by the way 120 fps is really if your device has 120 hertz of refresh rate but anyways let me just go ahead and close this Citra MMJ and now let's take a look at Lemuride emulator because we'll be confirming which is the best 3D simulator today right here now I think that Lemuride uses the base of official Citra Android and it does not have the large layout uh, uh, it, it cannot maximize the gameplay experience for you guys so it does not have any layout changing options it has lot of features missing but but you need to know that Lemuroid is just in its beta stage the 3ds simulation on Lemuroid will improve uh, way more in these upcoming years because as you know Citra MMJ has been there since the past 4 years I guess 4 to 5 years and Lemuroid is just an emulator which uh, added uh, 3ds simulation support recently so we cannot blame it all of the options will surely be added uh, in the upcoming years but let me tell you guys that uh, you will just have to go ahead and hold the settings bar enable fast forward it will basically boost your speed to 200 percentage and that's everything you can do in Lemuroid emulator but unfortunately guys unfortunately Lemuroid doesn't have good Mali GPU support which means that if you have a MediaTek processor device then MediaTek Exynos or Kirin processor then it's not playable it's not completely playable on low end devices just keep that in mind so in my opinion the brand new versions of Citra mmj android is the true king of 3d simulation on android let me know in the comment section down below which 3d simulator do you prefer lemuroid official citra or citra mmj android but anyways that's it for today's video goodbye